All right, what's up, guys? My name is P Team. Today we're going to be testing the CUDA SMG. We're going to be showing you how many hits it takes to kill, and the range, and how many bullets, and um, you're going to see everything about the gun here. So first, I'm going to show you the CUDA is one of the only SMGs to have a three-shot kill range. However, it is very, very close. It's less than shotgun range. So this right here is the three-shot kill range. One, two, three. I actually shot four bullets there, but um, over here, this guy's just a little bit farther back. One, two, three. He did not die there. So the three shot kill range. Come over here and stand a little bit, Hog, right there. One, two, three. So you can see he died with three bullets there, but it's very, very close. So, um, Swift, go back to the, that back right by the pillar over there. So over there, this is still a four-shot kill range with the CUDA. One, two, three, four. Shot out. So it's still a four-shot kill range at very, very long distances, so long that you can't count the bullets. One, two, three, four, four, five. It gets to a five-shot, but at at that range, you're so far, it's kind of hard to even count the bullets. Now, here's the other thing. Let me show you the accuracy here. This is with no foregrip. It's not a super, I mean, it's not a super accurate. It's going to definitely need a foregrip. Let me go back a little farther, and you can see, you can see the bullet kick, and you can see the speed. So it's not a super accurate gun. Um, having a foregrip would definitely help. But it's a three to four to five shot kill range. Um, that's it for today, guys. Uh, make sure you check out my other video comparing the CUDA and the Razorback. And you're going to see the differences between the two, the difference in range and the differences in bullets to kill. Thanks a lot, guys.